The current generation Maxima sedan has been on the market for a number of years now, and that means it's high time for an update, which the folks at Nissan have been working on for model year 2019. Since this is a refresh, the vehicle remains fundamentally unchanged. Major components like the underlying structure and engine soldier on. And if you're curious, a 300 horsepower 3.5 liter V6 fills the space ahead of its firewall. But as the old saying goes, the devil is in the details. Improving the breed, engineers focused on updating the Maxima's technology and refining its design both inside and out. Front and center, the car features a larger grille with a deeper V-motion applique, Nissan's signature exterior styling element. Headlamps of the LED variety are also standard. Now, round back, the taillights and fascia have been reworked, and there are now quad exhaust tips, an outlet for every one and a half cylinders. The new Maxima will be offered in five, count them up, five different trim levels, though top shelf platinum versions should be the only ones that roll on snazzy 19 inch wheels. Now, in addition to all of its other enhancements, the brakes, steering, and suspension have all been improved for the new model year. Inside, passengers will benefit from upgraded materials. There's new stitching, seat patterns, and updated speaker grills. Platinum Reserve models gain Rakuda tan semi-aniline leather, similar to what's offered in the GTR supercar, as well as satin bronze interior accents. Bringing the latest and greatest tech to market, Nissan Safety Shield 360 is offered. This suite of circuits and software bundles six advanced driver assistance features into one neat little package. It includes automatic emergency braking with pedestrian detection, blind spot monitoring, rear cross traffic alert, lane departure warning, automatic high beams, and rear automatic parking. Now, of course, all of this is standard on platinum models and bundled with the SR Premium package. Maxima is Nissan's flagship four-door, and it looks like they're keeping this car competitive, even if the sedan market has been contracting these days. Now, you can look for the new 2019 model at dealerships in December, which is, like, really soon.